Here at St. Andrew and the St. Taylor's Church in Cardiff, it's a mothering Sunday service. As well as the usual prayers and hymns, there were flowers for every woman in the congregation and plenty of love to go around. Mother's Day has its own place in the religion's calendar. It is a season where we, we, we fast and we try and be serious. Um, so, and it was the day when young people who were working away from home, working in the big house perhaps as a servant, were allowed to go home. So they were allowed to go home to their mother church and to their mothers. So that's where the tradition of Mothering Sunday came from. Many people prefer to buy gifts to show their love to their mother. Flowers, greeting cards and a Sunday lunch are the top choices for most people. My mom, I bought her some stuff right there in my bag. I'll post it to Ghana. She lives in Ghana, so I have to post it to her. Nothing too much, just, you know, some flowers and a, and a lovely card, as you can see. We are going to the restaurant. That's Bellini's restaurant, just behind the corner, just to have a meal together. Mother's Day is big as business, and there are no shortage of special offers and promotions. However much you love your mom, there will be somebody to help you show it. We had about 40 to 60 people coming on a Mother's Day. We got specials for a mothers, every mother having uh, free desserts on us. Uh, average spend per head is about 20, people per, uh, 20 pounds per person and lunchtime looked really promising and we had also lots of bookings for the evening times. Back in St. Andrew and the St. Taylor's Church, there is a different view about how Mother's Day and the money should mix. I think commercialization generally is a bad thing. It's a pity to lose the differences and the, specials, the special things of, of a given culture. It's the end of this year's Mother's Day service. The people here are celebrating without spending and they will do it all again next year. <laughs>